To summarize the retail strategy, it's quite frankly revolutionary. That's where we're going. It's digital, it's fast, it's quick, it's how to tie it all together. And one of the coolest things we're, we're doing right now is trying to take our consumer experience and put it into the retailer experience. In travel retail, Chinese people, they spend seven times more than the, 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 the Europeans and the Americans, seven times more. So it gives you an idea of this like ah, incredible need of buying and owning, and it's a very rich country. Today, China is uh, our biggest market. What I tend to profit a lot from, from being in China is to work with a younger audience that is slightly more playful than we find them in many other regions. And then, of course, the huge penetration of digital and not least mobile. You have to be fast and also you have to be, um, a, a respond quickly. So the, the main thing in the retail market, you have to experiment, experiment, experiment until you get the right answer. We have a lab in China. And through this lab, we incubate a lot of um, startups. Uh, it's not necessarily equity based. It's, it's mostly just test and learn. And so we're testing every week new startups and, and some of the technology are deployed uh, quickly. The other channel that's really developing quite significantly and, and, and morphing in a different way is the convenience store segment. It's the one segment that's not really influenced by online. Facial recognition, AR, there is a lot of technology that allow brands to really change the way uh, the, the, the purpose of the store. When you have the chance to have somebody stepping into your store, you need to grab its uh, data. We tend to say that the, uh, uh, the store is no longer a store, the store is a story. And we think that uh, offline, physical stores, uh, is the new channel, the new trendy channel. When we launched our SUV, the Levante, um, we launched it on Tmall, and there was um, an opening edition that um, no, this was actually the first time we did it. There were 100 Levantes that were sold in 18 seconds. That is unparalleled. That has never been seen in the history of Mas Maserati. 500 cars is a lot sold since we started our relationship with Tmall. We have to remember that we still sell more than 15,000 a year. So it's not, it's not everything, but it's an interesting tendency. Mobile commerce is, is key in China. Now it's more than 90% of our transaction. One of our partners is Swire, and they have the new Starbucks roastery in Shanghai. And they've done a fantastic job of, of creating a buzz around the product and standing in line and the social awareness. They have a very easy to use app. The acceleration of the change in retail is going to be incredible based upon this emotion. And the emotion for me is to get out of your daily things and go somewhere and spend your money, not only on products, but a mix of products, retail, and experience. 2018 is uh, obviously a, a, a year of, um, I think it's the innovative ideas and then consolidation of different uh, elements. There's one thing about ideas and the other thing is about how to put ideas into action. So 2018, I would say, is a uh, innovation plus action year. If you don't like complexity, uh, probably isn't the market for you. But uh, if you don't like ambiguity, not the market for you. Even the Coca-Cola company has been around 140 years is just discovering.